really neat photo from, from one of our viewers. Yeah, it's like, I didn't know that this color of pink even existed. Look at this. Mark Rodriguez sent us this picture from Dallas. Look wow. at that. It's purple. <laughs> but is it purple or is it fuchsia? It's kind of a combination of both. Gorgeous looking sunsets. Thank you all for sending in your pictures. I wish I could have uh, put all of them on air, but we just don't have enough time because I go through a long list of them. They were so gorgeous. Let's talk about the moon for a second. The flower moon. What's this? Well, this will be the last super moon of the year. Full moon, super moon. Super moon meaning it looks and appears like it's closer to the Earth in its orbit. So. The flower moon, you can catch it Thursday morning, 3.45 in the morning. Good news is, weather will be clear. Hey, and we're talking about the moon right now in our weather lessons. And there's more lessons to follow, too. If you'd like to check them out, go to coin.com forward slash weather dash kids. And parents, you can take a look, too. It's not just for kids. Everybody can benefit from those lessons. So current conditions in the upper 50s here. Portland, the Dow still holding on to 62 and seeing some showers continuing. Heavy at times along the coast, we're in the low 50s. Checking out our radar imagery, well, we see the next front already showing up on the coast. Astoria down to Tillamook, we have that light rain. Right around Portland, a few the sprinkles. As you head through the gorge, again, you're going to run into showers on and off. Zooming in a little bit closer here, you can see where that is. For the most part, you're dry, but this is the time now for that cold front to come through. It'll be in those overnight hours when we'll see some of the heaviest showers, but very brief and we might be able to pick up close to maybe a quarter of an inch of rain. Here's your area of low pressure, this elongated area of low pressure. Look at that. It's like a comma shape stretched out all the way from the Gulf of Alaska down to the California border. This is our cold front. It's moving on shore tonight through tomorrow morning. And then by the time we get to about 12, 1 o'clock, it should be out of here. Low 60s expected. Partly cloudy skies, a little bit cooler compared to what we had today. Let's talk about that timing. Here we go. This is 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. Heavy band of rain coming through, also central and eastern Oregon, expecting that. And your snow levels briefly down to about 4,000, 4,500 feet as we get to those early morning hours. Um, might be able to collect perhaps a half inch, maybe an inch of snow at that 5,000 foot level. And look at these temperatures. We are seeing quite a mix of conditions this week. We're going to go to the low to mid 80s Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and then back to more rain next Monday and Tuesday. Looks great. Still ahead.